Hello friends, today we are going to read Tiger, Tiger, Where Are You? The author is Mujahid Khan. The illustrator is Manjari Chakravarti and the publisher is Pratham Books. So let's read Tiger, Tiger, Where Are You? So in this picture, what do you see? You see this man standing here and he is looking at the ground and it sounds like he is looking for a tiger. Can you see anything in this picture that may be a tiger? Did you see the tail here? Let's read more about how this man finds the tiger. Tiger, tiger, where are you? I was just here. Didn't you see my watery trail by the lake? I took a nap in the cool water. So here you can see the man again and he is looking at the ground. You can see this patch of water here. There are these patches of water where the man is looking and that is a clue. It is a hint to the man that a tiger was here. Tiger, tiger, where are you? I was just here. Didn't you see my footprints on the soft soil? Look hard. I could be coming or going. So in this picture, what clue do you see? What hint do you see of the tiger? You can see these footprints. Are they made when the tiger is walking away from the water or towards the water. If it is towards the water, to drink the water and to rest in the water, then that is not where the tiger is now. That is where the tiger came from. So these footprints are going away from the water. That means they show which way the tiger may have gone. Tiger, tiger, where are you? I was just here. Didn't you see my scratch marks on the tree? I was sharpening my claws. Here you can see the scratches made by the tiger on the tree. The tiger was sharpening his claws. Tiger, tiger, where are you? I was just here. Didn't you smell my scent on the rock? The spray helps a tigress find me. So after scratching the tree and sharpening his claws, the tiger has gone to these rocks and sprayed his scent. He has urinated. He has gone number one on the rock and that smell helps other animals find him. Know that there is a tiger here and the tigress, the female tiger can find him that way. Tiger, tiger, where are you? I was just here. Didn't you see what I ate yesterday? The hair and nails should give you a clue. And here again are these two men looking at this poop on the ground. This is tiger poop and it has hair and nails of the animal that it ate yesterday. And this should be a clue, a hint about what the tiger ate. 
Tiger, tiger, where are you? I was just here. Didn't you hear that loud mouth Langur's warning? He told the entire forest that I was on the move. So you can see these langurs in the picture. The tiger calls them loud mouths. It means they are always talking, telling everybody secrets. The tiger is trying to stay quiet, but the langur is telling everybody, hey, there is a tiger here. And they chatter. They make noises when they see the tiger. They are up safe in the trees, but they still give that warning. Tiger, tiger, where are you? I was just here. Didn't you hear my growl? I want other tigers to know that this part of the forest is mine. So, What's the next clue these two people find? They hear something. They hear the tiger's growl. The tiger growls now and then to let the other tigers in the forest know this is my place. This is my forest. This part is mine. Tiger, tiger, where are you? I was just here. Didn't you see my false eyes? I tricked you. So here you can see these that look like the tiger's eyes. Are they really? No. Tigers on the backs of their ears have these patterns that look like eyes. And this fools the other animals into thinking that the tiger is looking at them. And this is what we are seeing in this picture. Tiger, tiger, where are you? Here I am. You found me. And here is the tiger. Meet Mujahid and his team members. Researchers at the National Center for Biological Sciences, Tata Institute of Fundamental Research, attempt to understand living systems. Mujahid is a part of the Ranthambore Tiger Project, where Uma Ramakrishnan, Senior Fellow, DBT Welcome India Alliance, NCBS, and her group, Anubhav Khan and Kaushal Patel, are trying to understand the genetic impacts of isolation and inbreeding on endangered species. This is why he spends a lot of Time tracking tigers through their pug marks, claw marks, and scat. Tigers are in danger of dying completely because people hunt them. The Ranthambore Tiger Project wants to save the tigers from dying completely. So, this is the team of people doing research. They are studying tigers. They are finding out more about them and how to keep them alive. And this helps increase the number of tigers in the world so that they don't die completely. So these people spend a lot of time tracking tigers, following them and finding out more about them. And here is a close-up of the tiger's skin. I hope you enjoyed this story. Thank you.
the difficult words in this story are loud mouth someone who talks too much tells secrets bug marks footprints endangered at risk of completely dying out scat poop usually of wild animals isolation being separate from others usually of the same kind of creature try these questions write down the list of clues mentioned in the story to track the tiger can you spot them in the pictures have you used a clue like this to know that a creature was present for example feathers poop nests write about it